In this final section of this series, we will try to make some food using the solar box cooker we made. When you want to use your solar cooker, make sure that you have oriented it based on the time of the day that you start using it towards the sun. You can see the reflection coming from the, from, from the box down to your food. For better monitoring or testing, you can use either a digital thermometer like the one we use here or you can use a, a simple oven type or for cooking purposes thermometer. This digital thermometer uses a little cable called thermocouple that you can actually uh, take it up on a surface or you can measure air temperature and it can give you a very precise uh, measurement. Let it for a few hours just by sometimes checking the orientation that's correctly and when the food is ready just enjoy it.